Hi guys, this is Jamie. I want to welcome you to my channel today. I hope everyone is doing well and staying safe. Today I have a flip through video for you guys on a book that was requested flip from my haul, um, my birthday haul. And that is this one. It's called Happy Mandala's Coloring Book by LJ Knight. This was gifted to me by Ashley from Ashley's Coloring Journey. And um, I had actually a couple requests to flip through this. And so I would be happy to. Um, so it says 30 cute mandalas to color and enjoy. And that's color with a U. So that's the UK type version. And we will get started. So I like to take my little things in there so I can remember who gave them to me. Uh, just says Happy Mandalas. This is the introductory title page. We all know that. And look how cute. Those are bees. Flowers. Right here is just like copyright information and um, kind of like just information about this book. You can use different things. The difficulty, difficulty levels ranges from easy to moderate in this particular book. And I'm just going to point out a couple things on this first page. On the corner here, it does say LJ Knight. So that is the um, illustrated. So this is their little copyright little stamp thing that they've put there. And this first one is the snails. Very cute. Next one is snakes. And these are relatively simple. This one's even simpler. We've got some boats on the water and a starfish in the middle. This one kind of reminds me of Easter, but you could do this at any time of the year. Just giant carrots. This one is basically, you know, your different weather, basically. So we've got snow here, we've got rain. I think this is like partly sunny. Lightning, thunderstorms, they're sunny. There's a rainbow on that one, you know. This one's a little more busy than the one you just saw. So this is like the ice cream cakes page. If you had a birthday, you could do this for your birthday because there's a candle in the middle. This one's really fun. It's a space one. Um, this says kitty cat. So if you like kitty cats, you'll like this one. This one is more simple because it's not like a traditional mandala. It's more a picture with a border around it, which I like these. They remind me of Camellia Angel Colva. Hearts. That one would be good for Valentine's Day. This one would be good for Christmas. We've got snowmen and we've got um, Christmas trees with a present in the middle. This is a night one. So we've got stars and moons. And this giant thing looks kind of like a sun or starburst even. A puppy one. So they got one for the puppy lovers as well. Here is a butterfly. We've got leaves going around. Owls. Very cute. Now this one's definitely an Easter one because we've got Easter eggs. Oh, and then you guys get to see the one that I just colored. So I colored this one. I think this is supposed to be flowers. And I used permanent markers and gel pens. And then I also used, um, like the background here is the, the pastel, um, Jane Davenport pastels. So you can see what the back looks like that. And I put a blotter page so it wouldn't affect this next one, but it turned out cute. It looks nice. There's the B one. This one's very simple. Wouldn't be too hard to color this one. This one's fun. It has little monsters. 
could do this one for Halloween. That would be cute. Here you have the emoji one. This is the dinosaur one that I showed. I kind of talked about when I was doing the haul. Here's fruit. We've got bananas, apples, pineapple, strawberries, pears. That one's another one that's kind of flowers mixed with hearts. This one's cute with the frogs. I like to color frogs. I think they're cute. Perfect for Halloween. You could use this one for the spooky hashtag. I don't know if you wanted to color it right away. This one has a rainbow. That's fun. This one, I think, I think it's supposed to be like a flower design, but the fact that this has like vampire teeth makes me think of Halloween. <laughs> And this one has birds, little Tweety birds, and a tree. And the tree is actually what divides this. And it actually is like a peace sign that's been tilted. This one's cute. This one kind of reminds me of the Yippie Kawaii um, mandalas. These little cute kawaii-like things. And then they give you some bonus pages if you want more information. Here is their website. So, bonus page number one. This is from a Geometric Patterns Coloring Book. This is the Easy Mandala Coloring Book. I might color these, I don't know. Through the Kaleidoscope um, Coloring Book. This mandala is not too bad. Um, this is Abstract Mandalas 2. This one's very simple. It's called Big and Bold Mandala's Coloring Book. And kind of a funky one. This is called Easy Doodles Abstract Coloring Book. I'm just reading the titles from down here. This is the Magic Mandala 2 Coloring Book for Kids. Or you could use it. It doesn't have to be for kids. And the back here... Thank you for buying this. Please visit my website. And you can also check them out on Amazon. And they give you... This one has been left blank for color testing. And then they give you this totally blank one with the little um, publishing date on the very back there. So that is 30 cute mandalas to color and enjoy here. Uh, Happy Mandala's Coloring Book by L.J. Knight. I hope you guys enjoyed this flip through and I hope everyone could see it all right. I'm trying to play with my camera angles to make sure my books are in frame. Sometimes um, the camera is too close to my desk and I don't get everything in frame. So I'm hoping, I'm hoping it was all in frame for you guys. And I will see you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching. Bye, guys.